It has been a mighty wet day across Alabama. Lots of rain to talk about tracking from west east across the state. In fact, it's soaking out there. Just about everybody is getting at least some light to moderate rain right now. Some embedded heavy rain, uh, not really over west Alabama. Most of the heavy rain in west Alabama has moved off towards the east now, but still uh, some shower activity from about Brilliant to Hamilton to Winfield down towards a Fayette and Jasper getting a little bit of rain now. For Tuscaloosa, some light rain falling near the city, not in the city right now, but we got another batch of rain just to the west of town over Pickens County out towards a Coker and West Tuscaloosa County. In fact, let's go live with our Tuscaloosa Tower camera, see what it looks like. And we are looking northeast across the campus, University of Alabama, kind of a gloomy looking day out there. And again, uh, one thing you notice, it has been a wet day. It will continue to be a wet evening, so we've got plants outdoors. Have the umbrella handy. Let's go back over to radar track. Some more rain for you down over southwest Alabama near Linden. A stronger storm moving in now out of the Sweetwater area and Myrtle Wood track it in from the uh, southwest uh, moving northeast around 20 to 30 miles per hour. More heavier rain along Interstate 65 now starting to move east of Alabaster and Chelsea now. Also some heavier rain over northeast Alabama. Gas and Piedmont Jacksonville down towards Anniston. Uh, you are getting a lot of rain, some thunder with that, but no severe weather. We are watching though with interest some severe storms back in Mississippi across the central parts of Mississippi and these are moving our way. Once they reach West Alabama, they will drop below severe limits, but some stronger storms are possible later this evening and tonight. Here is that forecast tonight and again. We'll focus on the chance for rain and storms through 10, at least 10 o'clock. After 10 towards midnight tonight, some showers still sticking around, but it will be warm and muggy overnight tonight. But a lot of rain on radar. The first batch of rain uh, moving in earlier this morning. That is now over to Georgia, weakening. Uh, but there's the final round of showers and thunderstorms back along the Mississippi River towards the Jackson and Meridian. Again, that's what's going to be tracking through here. That will be an end to the rain for much of the week as we will start to go dry. It stays warm out there. Temperatures generally the same. This evening to upper 60s as your warm front moves northward tomorrow and on Wednesday. Most of the rain will go with that, but as we go into Wednesday, and Thursday, even tomorrow, some showers could be around, but the risk of rain is only about 10 to 20%. So most neighborhoods will stay rain free. Forecast tonight, showers and thunderstorms early ending 82 tomorrow. Uh, we'll stay warm all week with a good chance for storms returning. It was going to Friday. Temperatures topping out in the 70s on Friday. A fairly wet weekend ahead. Lynn.